Hello everybody, Hooded Cobra Commander 788 here, and welcome to the first video of the year 2021. This is a quick shot of Buzzer, the Dreadnought. In addition to giving you a quick look at the Buzzer action figure, I'm also going to tell you the theme for this year. I will do that at the end of this video. Buzzer was a Dreadnought. The Dreadnoughts was a motorcycle gang led by Zartan, the Master of Disguise. The Dreadnoughts were modeled after the gangs in the movie Mad Max. Buzzer was released least in 1985, but he has the articulation of a 1984 action figure. He did not have the ball jointed neck. Buzzer's accessories included a chain flail weapon with a blade. It's made of silver, soft, flexible plastic. He also had a chainsaw with the back end of it looking very much like a rifle with a stock and a grip. He also had a backpack that was two pieces. The backpack had a rack that held a gas can that can be removed. There we go. A removable gas can. It's hollow on the other side. Buzzer has silver sunglasses and blonde hair with a ponytail. He is wearing a khaki shirt with the sleeves ripped off. He has a green strap with some grenades and some silver details. He has bare arms and a tattoo on the left arm. He's wearing what looks like uh, light blue denim trousers with some armor plate on the front and he has black boots. Although there are no variations of the buzzer action figure, there are no fewer than five variations of the file card. That includes several text variations. There's even one that has a sticker with new text that covers over the old text. That's bizarre. There were three Dreadnoughts released in 1985, buzzer, Ripper and Torch, and they were led by Zartan, the Master of Disguise, from 1984. I've already reviewed all of these figures, but they should each get a fresh review this year. Considering the theme for this year, the Dreadnoughts could be considered the first sub-team to be introduced in G.I. Joe, and the theme for 2021 on the HCC 788 channel will be sub-teams. That was my brief look at Buzzer, the Dreadnought. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to the YouTube channel for G.I. Joe toy reviews. I'm currently working on the first full review of the year. You should get that shortly. I'm enlisting some help with that one. The first full review of 2021 will be a super review of a prominent character that was the leader of no fewer than two G.I. Joe sub-teams. Subscribe so you don't miss it and watch for it soon. And until then, remember only G.I. Joe is G.I. Joe.